which is the strongest fighter jet currently in the service under the Indian Air Force. And can it give a tough competition to the Chinese Air Force? Hi, I'm Archita and welcome back to this new video where we are going to discuss about the strongest fighter that Indian Air Force currently possess. So with that say, let's roll the intro. Sukhoi Su-30 MKI made by Russia and Rafael made by Dassault France are two potent fighters of the Indian Air Force to date. Right now, Indian Air Force is working and planning to procure Tejas and other fighter aircraft to supersede its neighbor, PLA. People Liberation Army Air Force has a very diverse and advanced arsenal of weapons and fighters. J-20 is a twin jet. It's an all-weather jet fighter aircraft and it is built for air superiority and stealth. Right now, there are 20 J-20s in service with People Liberation Army Air Force. And CAC has a production capacity of 200 a year for these plants reportedly. J-31 is an export version of J-20 fighters. People Liberation Army Air Force also has 565 J-10 multi-role fighters with the latest technologies and avionics. Not only this, but they have about 200 J-16s which are also produced by China an older, third-generation, multi-role strike fighter. These are the fighters produced by China. And when we talk about J-11, then it is produced by China and Russia in collaboration. But People Liberation Army Air Force also fields 100 Su-27s, 100 Su-30s and about 40 Su-35s. So in this theory, it's difficult for IAF to use its workhorse Su-30 MKI to outpace People Liberation Army Air Force. Because at this point, China has beyond visual range BVR missiles like PL-10 with 150 km to 200 km target range and PL-15 with 200 km to 300 km target range and a strong network of airborne early warning, control and avionics aircraft. These are pretty useful in air-to-air -air combat and situational awareness can make fighters' communication better with other assists in the air as well as on the ground. IAF is in the process of acquiring the AUX and electronic warfare aircraft after they lost a MiG-21 Bison during a brief altercation with the Pakistan Air Force in 2019. Now, it is not always about the fighter jets. It also depends on electronic warfare and ops, as well as on the munition a plane is carrying. The technology of the fighter jet is also factored in, but the biggest of all is the pilot in the cockpit. But one should never forget that India has S-400 too. Bigger numbers of Chinese jets are just a paper jet after crossing the Himalayas and facing the S-400. What you think about these fighter jets? Do let us know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching the video. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next one.